All right, there we're getting it started. Loser semis, FD. Let's go. You know, I, I just it's so interesting that uh, DK will plays with DK, and he's in the same situation that uh, Bum was in way back at MLG when he had to play both M2K and Isaiah. Right, and it was Fox Falcon. <laughs> <laughs> Well, generations later, he does indeed have to do the Fox Falcon bracket. Uh, gauntlet, not bracket. Gauntlet. And, wow. See, now... The kill stage is all open right now, but I still, like... He has to stay focused, because... Just like Captain Falcon, Fox Falls just as quick, so all DK Will needs is that grab. Wow. Oh my God. It doesn't matter. The kill stage is now ahead a whole stop. Or not a whole stop, but it might as well be. 33% isn't much. Caught him with a two-piece the biscuit. Wow. The Kill Sage is making a statement right now. He might take out one of Smash 4's top players. One of, one of the uh, people who were, you know, expected to win, or at least make the top three. Yeah. Who who put the Kill Sage into loser's bracket? I don't Who knows? Wow, by the looks of this, it doesn't look like it was DK Will. Nope. He is all over DK Will right now. He knows my games. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Great wow, dude. I really like the Kill Sage's playstyle. He has like a playstyle where like he he's very rushed down, but he also won't let you get in on him either. No. So he has that defense too. Exactly. And it's really good stage control. Yeah. Even when you think you have stage control, he's got it. Oh my god. I don't know if it's the stage or what, but DK Will better start thinking about his counter picks, man, because that is oh, not that it. Was, that almost was. I think that was an executional area because I know that is guaranteed. Yeah. And back air? No, nah, not going to do it. I don't know. All right. The laser. I mean, any any damage is good damage. Oh, what for up smash? Up smash. Uh -oh. Wow. Well, uh -oh. oh my god. I'm, okay, oh. that was nice. I'm pretty sure a bath would have killed him in that situation, but I mean, it doesn't matter. He still ended up with the kill. Oh wow. Okay, yeah, you got him. You see that? The kill stage went for that trick that he did earlier. I guess. Oh, no, we did. Huh? Oh, I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I thought we had a JV2, but then I saw he had that little 6% off. Oh, oh no, no, no JV2. The Kill Sage loves going for that fake up air into up smash, but DK Will didn't fall for the air dodge, but he hit him with it anyway. Yeah. But, yeah, that's very good, uh, Fox. Oh, Tech. Fox is watching the home. You guys should do that. Because I know people love air dodging against Fox in the air because they're so scared of the up air. It's really strong. All right. 1 0. DK Will versus the Kill Sage, Smashville. All right, now we're going to see if Smashville is going to make a big difference for uh, DK Will. Yeah, we'll see. That was a nice running. Oh, is that the Gimp? Nope. Nice. Okay, oh, oh down throw to up air. Up air. Up air. Wow. Will cannot make it to the ground right now. Oh, I love how aggressive the kill stage is playing right now. <laughs> Me too. He is like all over DK Will. It almost seems like he was 100% prepared for this matchup. I think he was. You know, I, I I seen him playing DK Will in friendlies yesterday, so he might have like studied what he did wrong. Because DK Will was winning this, the majority of his friendlies, and this is like completely like night and day difference right now. That can happen. Yeah. He definitely looks like he was prepared for this matchup. Oh, my God. The Kill Sage. He's getting these crazy reads. I don't... Huh? He's really patient, yeah. That was really risky, too, because if he would have got shielded, a bat would have killed, but he was very confident in his read. All right, the Kill Sage. All... Oh. Moving around. Right. That was a beautiful read oh on forward air and up air. Yeah, forward air is a great combo to lead into up air, and that won't do it. 
And that will do it. Okay, 55-0. We'll see what happens. All right, DK will. Starting to come, make a slight comeback. That focus. Okay. The match has slowed down a little bit, which yeah. I think is favoring Will. Uh, oh, wow. Better. Yeah, DK World has slowed down the pace of the match, which I think is helping him, giving him some breathing room, a chance to think. The Kill Sage is... Oh. Uh, the Kill Sage is one up smash away from victory. Oh, oh my god! Yeah. He, he has done that so many times. <laughs> it's so scary, because like... He's right there, and if you don't air dodge in the up smash, it's almost like a frame trap. It's almost like you don't have a choice. And the crazy part about it is, like, you think about it, it's a read, but it's also a reaction. Yeah, I feel like he waits for the air dodge, and then he drops down, fast balls, up smashes. That is such a good setup. Oh, all right, DK, well, kind of picking the Sheik. Um, I am pretty positive that Kill Sage has plenty of experience in the Sheik matchup. Yeah. <laughs> Because, I mean, if a, tar if a person doesn't main cheat, they have a pocket cheat. So, we will... We'll see. DK Wells, uh... Sheik is definitely nothing to sneeze at. Again, we had mentioned before that he trains with Bum. And I know he uses Sheik quite a bit. With who? Ah, uh, Bum. Bum? Uh, the DK player? Yeah. I didn't know Do Bum played uh, Smash 4. Oh, yeah. He streams, uh, he streams with it regularly, too. Bum? Yeah. And who's he, who's he play? DK. DK. Well, I'm sure he loves DK in this game. <laughs> FGC, man. These FGC, these guys have no mercy when it comes to their players. Oh, my. All right, well. Will needs to think of something. Oh, wow. The kill stage uh, oh, going. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> wow! Well, trash talk has started. The crowd is getting <laughs> super hyped for this match. Wow! The Kill Sage is about to 3-0 DK Will. That is making a statement if I've ever seen it. Yeah, definitely. Wow! The Kill Sage is. Ooh, I have never seen a Foss play quite like him. And I think he's playing Foss the way, like he's optimizing the character. I really think he is. That was, uh, oh, oh wow, that was nice. That was nice. DK Well getting ready to get not be knocked out with a 3-0. The scary thing is DK Will is like doing some really interesting things with Sheik. It's just that the kill sage is like, okay. That's cool, but I'm fine and I'm just gonna rush you down. He's like, yo, I understand you got this nice Sheik and, and I'm happy for you. But right now I'm about to take this. You think you think it's fifty fifty? Who's told you that? I I agree. Well, I think it's slightly in Sheet's favor. But the kill stage is definitely looking making it look like a good matchup for Fox. Lair, uh, DK's will Sheik is not a pocket Sheik by any means. His Sheik is actually very good. Yeah. The kill stage is just like. I'm sure he knew this matchup. Oh, the tag! <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, wow, the bouncing fish. That was beautiful. All right, there we go, bouncing fish. There you go, Larry. Uh, DK Well getting stuff started. He, he just turned the button on. He turned. Gosh, the crowd is going nuts. The crowd is very hyped for this. DK Will with the combos. That grab, what's it going to lead to? Neutral air. All right, DK Will might take this game, actually. He has turned this around. Oh, missed the up air. Oh, okay. Good option by DK Will. Oh! Okay, Will's not falling for it anymore. Is that it? No, it is no, not. Not yet. 
What about I was wondering if he was going to use his heels. Alright, up tilt. Oh, is that it? That yes, it is! DK Will 3 0. Kill Sage 3 0's. IQ, HQ, DK Will. And right now. Oh my gosh. DK Will 